It started out as a typical day for mother Shakia Scholz. It was Thursday morning. I ordered an Uber to take me and my children to school. Scholz car was being borrowed, so she and her kids caught a ride to campus. Then she headed back home in the same Uber. He was a bit frustrated because of the traffic. Uh, the GPS was kind of throwing him every which way. I was trying to tell him directions. Um, we had turned around a couple of times and we ended up here. Here being this parking lot of Callahan's General Store off Highway 183. And stopped and was just like, get out. And I was like, no. And then he just reached over, kind of was here with it. According to the arrest affidavit, the driver stopped and pointed a gun at her, swearing at her and telling her to get out of his car. When he said it a second time, she says she did. Scholes has a license to carry and had a gun in her purse at the time, but says at that point she thought it'd be a bad idea to pull it out. She got out of the car and called police. The driver, Frederick Roy Clark, came into the station for questioning, and a gun was on him at the time. According to the affidavit, he claimed Scholes appeared agitated and rushed and was cursing during the ride, which she denied. He also told the detective that in the past, he has told unruly passengers, quote, if I have to pull over, you're going to have a walk of shame moment because you don't know how to conduct yourself. He's now facing a charge of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon, but Scholes isn't focused on that. This is more so about Uber at this point to, you know, you have to be more careful for a situation like that to even have the opportunity to happen is totally unacceptable.